Welcome to Wallatopia. Thanks for joining us as I take you through my long-term carry experience with the Ridge Aluminum Band Wallet. Now, the wallet I have here is the one I took out, plus its contents. You can see how big I had this. Uh, for 20 days, and it shows really no worse for wear, so there's no need to show a before and after picture of this. Now, before we get into the likes and dislikes, let's quickly review the features of the Ridge Aluminum Band Wallet. All right, as you can see, it's a band wallet. I have it full of things. They say to not have more than 12 cards uh, in the main band area in here for fear of it particularly potentially stretching out. We have the secondary band here in the back for cards or additional cash if you want. It has its push mechanism here. That's your slot where you can push things out. And again, you can fan out the cards from here, pull out what you want and uh, put them back in. It's very easy to open here and to pull cards out, put them back in with ease and it uh, slides in and out very well. So that's just a, a simple review of the features of the Ridge Aluminum Band Wallet. General assessment of this wallet is that as a band wallet, and I've brought this up in my reviews uh, about this wallet before, it's one of the best I've ever used. The ease of use directly correlates to the conscientious desi design decisions the company made. Now this translates into being able to easily open the wallet for card insertion and extraction. Frictionless movement of cards in and out of this uh, and safely knowing that what's put in there won't fall out because of the bands that are protecting it, as well as even this back piece that has these grip grommets on here that uh, holds what you put in here. So you really have ha had no issue with anything even sliding out or potentially sliding out. Overall, band wallets suffer from the same problem. All your content is stacked into a single space with no organizational method provided by the wallet. You know, unlike other you know, wallets, what this means is that under normal wallets you have different slots that you can put things into and it provides an organizational space. But as you can easily uh, see, you're working with a monolithic stack. So you have to be very strategic in how you place your cards. Putting the most used cards as your first two in the front or in the back is, general, is the general practice that you do and have with a band wallet. Now, if you have more than six active cards, talking about three in the front, three in the back, then uh, you've probably got a bigger problem and you need to talk about doing a, a wallet audit. But setting that aside, rich wallets help alleviate that disadvantage because it's no big deal to pull the entire stack out and then put them back in. I mean, I can easily pull the whole stack out I can put the whole thing back in, just slips right in without any issues. Now for the dislikes, I have none directed at Ridge's offering. Band wallets have their own issues, which I already discussed. And really, Ridge has gone about designing features to ease those problems. If you have up to the maximum number of cards, the wallet begins to feel like a deck of cards in your pocket. If you're truly using it as a minimalist wallet, then it's a wonderful experience because it's very thin. For the likes, Ridge has enhanced the ability of the band wallet category through their offering by what I mentioned during their review, as well as talking about it here, the ease of transitioning cards in and out, easy opening of the sandwich to put them in, the ability to easily fix this wallet if something goes wrong, and really feeling confident that what you, what you put in this and your contents are secure. Those are really the likes about this particular implementation of Ridges for a band wallet. And there you go. If you like band wallets and haven't looked at Ridge yet, give them a try. If you like uh, to see the full review of this product, please look at the banner above. Thanks for joining us and always leave us a comment and your experiences with this particular wallet. Thanks, bye.